Hey everyone, so an issue that I faced with uh, video game controllers is the matter of uh, battery life. Uh, now, you'd say when you're playing on the 360 or the PS3, you're only going to be using one, maybe two controllers if you have someone over. Um, but the number one issue is usually with the Wii controller. Um, with the Wii controller, because it's more of a family system, uh, you're likely to be using the maximum amount of controllers that you can use at once, and that's four controllers for four-player uh, Wii Sports and Wii Resort games. And because each controller takes two batteries, that's eight batteries in all that you'll need. Now, some people might have stockpiles of batteries, uh, other people might be, be using uh, rechargeable batteries, but it's just no help really because uh, you always need batteries for something and it always seems like your batteries are just all being used. Now, I thought to myself, uh, what can I get? There's no way to uh, charge uh, these controllers other than by uh, getting a docking station or um anything else so i decided on looking for charging mats uh so i picked up this it's the charging mat by uh intech and it works on uh ps3 uh 360 and wii uh controllers and they come with their own special uh battery packs and i only purchased ones for the wii and for the 360 because for me, the idea of a rechargeable battery pack for the PS3 is sort of just ridiculous considering there's a built-in uh, battery pack and you can just charge it by plugging in the USB cable and it's just like a wired controller. Um, so it was just completely pointless. Um, now, I got these, and they don't look that much different from uh, just the regular uh, battery packs. They just have these uh, magnetic contacts on the back, um, and they're about twice as thick. Um, now, the reason for getting these was pretty much that if one runs out, then I can just swap it out, put another one back in, and then when I'm done, I can just leave it on the mat and let it charge. Um, but I had the longest time trying to get these to, uh, charge properly. Um, on the side here, there's a little LED, uh, notification light, uh, that'll let you know, um, once it's made the connection and then, uh, that is charging, it'll cycle from, uh, blue to red and then the light should remain red to signify that it's charging. Um, and that it needs a charge, and once it's blue again, it means that it's done charging. But I found the indication light to be of no help at all, because I could just put it on the charging mat, and after an hour, it'll be like, oh, light's blue, it must be uh, done. And you pick it off, and then I just thought, why not just put it back on and see what happens, and it would remain red. Um, and even after an entire night of leaving them on the charging mat, uh, I removed them, uh, see that the light was blue when I took it off, put it back on, and the light is then red, uh, when I put it back on the charging mat. Now, I'm not saying that there's an issue with, uh, holding the charge, um, I think just the issue alone is with the indicator light. Um, but the other issue that I had with this was getting the battery packs to charge in the first place. Now, I put them on the charging mat, and for some reason, uh, at the beginning, they all cycled through from blue light to red light to no light. And I'm like, what does that mean? Is it charging? Is it not charging? Um... I tried calling the company, but there there's no phone number for Intech. I tried emailing them, no response. So the first time I just put them on there, waited a few hours, 
Uh, and after a few hours, most of them seem to be charging, except for one of the 360 uh, battery packs. I got two boxes of them, so uh, each box had two in them. So I have four, so three plus uh, the one in the controller right now. And the one just seemed to not want to charge. Uh, in the end, after a good day, it was able to at least uh, light up, knowing that it was getting some kind of a charge. So after a little hassle, it, they seem to work now. Um, the reason that I went with this exactly is pretty much because they were on a clearance sale at uh, at the source uh, at the location that I went to they had the charging mat uh, on clearance for ten dollars and then they had the uh, battery packs um, for six dollars a box and like my saying is why not um, I needed something specific to just uh, the controllers so I don't waste all my batteries on uh, just video game controllers um, so I bought a couple packs of uh, these uh, rechargeable battery packs specifically made for the uh, handheld uh, not the handhelds the controllers sorry about that and uh, I thought that would be the end of my uh, my troubles but I'm still not sold uh, on this specific brand uh, I was looking at charging cradles also like how they have for the uh, Wii controllers and the uh, uh, PlayStation move controllers but those just look they they just look weird this one I thought it's a flat mat uh, it accommodates lots and lots of controllers and the picture makes it look even smaller than it is uh, by having the controller pretty much off of it um, but if you look at the controller compared to the box it was pretty much the size of the box um, it can fit a lot on there and I was able to charge uh, five at a time uh, even though it suggests that you only charge four controllers at a time I still didn't see any uh, problems with uh, charging five uh, controllers at a time. Um, now I didn't actually put all the controllers on there to charge, I just took all the uh, battery packs and I put them on there to charge and they they seemed to charge just fine uh, once I got through all those other issues. Um, I'll be posting a review on my website, a more complete uh, analysis of uh, uh, this charging mat, uh, but for now I have to say that it looks like it'll do the job. Again, there's no reason for getting it if you uh, have just a PS3. Uh, if you have a Wii, and especially if you have um, a large enough family or a large enough group of people that are using the Wii constantly, uh, you might want to think about getting a charging mat or some kind of a charging dock or cradle. Um, just because it'll save you a lot of money on batteries in the long run. Especially uh, for this instance, considering it was on a clearance sale, um, it pretty much cost the same amount for just that and each individual uh, part as much as uh, uh, just a regular pack of rechargeable batteries. So it pretty much uh, equals out to the same amount of money. So. Uh, yep, that's it, and now I'm just rambling. See ya.